Good morning. Hey, welcome to all the new folks and welcome back everybody. How the heck is everybody? Hope you guys enjoy the weekend. It's absolutely beautiful, but it's hecka hot here still in Arizona. Anyway, you guys, oh, yesterday we did an OMAD. And I want you guys to remember that everything that you eat yesterday or the day prior to that, any stress, lack of sleep, medications, inflammation as aches, pains, anything like that can directly affect your weight loss or gain or maintenance the next day. So with that, you guys, let's get started. Let me share with you guys what we had because we had a nomad yesterday. We had a 20 hour fast and we actually, it, it was late fast. I don't think we ate until like two o'clock, did we? Something like that. Something yeah. like that. I couldn't remember if it was um, what time we finished eating. So I, I erred on the lower side. Anyway, you guys, I had 10.5 ounces of, of sirloin steak. Harry had, um, actually he did not have a Nomad because he had ground beef and 2.5 ounces of sirloin steak and then he came back and had more ground beef a few hours later. So he totaled it in here, but he had two meals. He also had, we had two scoops of collagen I had stevia in my black coffee. Here he had bang and zevia to drink. These are my macros, not Harry's. Harry is not tracking. Um, he basically kind of eats the same as me, but he eats more protein than I do. He's, he needs more calories. He's a man. Anyway, you guys, my daily total yesterday was zero carbs, 60. 7% fat with 79 grams of fat. I had 33 grams of protein for 89 grams of protein. And my total carbs were 1,250 calories. Now yesterday, yay, you guys, it was, it was really weird. I started off really well. I did um, all the stuff I needed to do. I painted my nails. I did my microdome on my face. I did my eyebrows, I went in the sauna, and I lost track of time, and I think I waited too long because my blood sugar hit a really low. Started getting shaky, started getting nervous, and I told Harry, come on, we need to get something to eat. Um, after that, I felt okay, but I wasn't in my best game for the rest of the day. So it was, it was just off. And I don't know if it, now I took electrolytes into the sauna with me and had 20 ounce glass of the Redmond's um, Re real light uh, electrolytes. Let me share those with you guys real quick because they're really good. They make lemon lime, they make mixed berry, but I had the real light electrolyte mix and it's got great electrolytes and 60 trace minerals in it when you are doing a sauna or you're doing a jacuzzi and you're heating your body up and you start sweating like I did you really need the electrolytes I also took um, my electrolyte pill later because I just couldn't catch up on my electrolytes for some reason. I took my essential electrolytes that I get. I don't know if you can see them. So anyway, you guys, I mean, other than that, we were totally keto. And you guys, you guys, da 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 da. Harry has a new low, you guys. 178.0. You go, Harry. Whoop, whoop, whoop. You Congratulations. You're in the 170s, hopefully, to stay. I went down to 179.6, so I went down two tenths of a point. I even ate uh, Redmond's Real, the rock salt, that coarse granules last night at TV because I was just trying to replenish my electrolytes. I was going crazy. Anyway, you guys, let's go to the big board. Harry's beautiful big board. Here we go. Do you want to go over it, Harry? 
or mm -hmm. what we had were the steaks, ground beef, steaks, yeah, no dairy. Yeah, I don't think we had enough meat. Well, we obviously had something right because we lost weight. Well, I think that's because of a low calorie count. Well, yeah, and I just but, was off. You know, and I, I just needed the electrolytes. I wasn't hungry, but I could feel that I needed the electrolytes. So anyway, you guys, here's the deal. Let me go back over here. Today is day seven of my carnivore elimination portion of my diet. I have been fighting, do I want to add back eggs or dairy? Eggs versus dairy. And I'm thinking I want to add back eggs because it's one food source. If I add back dairy, that can be cream, that can be sour cream, that can be cheeses. And there's a lot in the realm and that could be butter. So I'd rather choose eggs. And I'm going to eat eggs for three days, which will be eggs and beef, black coffee, collagen, my stevia. I'm just adding one food, which are eggs, to my beef, my carnivore diet. I'm going to do it for three days, okay? So I'm going to do it today, Monday and Tuesday. Tuesday's our last, our 30th day of the carnivore challenge, and I'm going to see if I go up or down or I remain the same. I did my macros preemptively in my phone because I want to have the same caloric value right around 12 1300 calories and i added in eggs already so i'm going to start out with two eggs and some ground beef this morning to break our fast and then tonight i'm going to have some chuck steak because i've got them in the refrigerator and they're beautiful and they're calling my name wendy 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 gotta have some gotta try it anyway folks we will come back when it's break fast Okay, you guys, I programmed in six ounces for breakfast of ground beef and two eggs. So let me get my six ounces of ground beef in here. Six ounces for me. You have over a little over six ounces. Where's Sally's? Over here. We'll save that for her. Okay, you guys, I am going to nuke the ground beef, and then I'm going to get the eggs in. Matter of fact, I'll get the eggs in real quick. You want to make sure your beef tallow is really hot. Oops, there's a couple little pieces of beef in there. Beef. gets a little bit of that. Can you put the lid on and I'll give Sally some of this? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Is that good? Oh yeah. Okay, let me wash my hands. Let me get the beef in. And we'll come back, you guys, when it's break when it's uh ground beef and eggs. Let me get mine in. These are done. That's for sure. Ooh. I way overcooked those puppies. Why, why does tallow make my eggs stick to the pan? I put two tablespoons of tallow in so that I could have enough tallow in here so these guys wouldn't stick. I got it hot first. And they just want to stick, little suckers. Four seconds here. I'll take that. A little bit of tallow. A little bit of tallow. Any other kind of seasoning on yours, honey? Yeah, I want butt rub on there. On this? Mm hmm Okay, sounds good. A little bit of Byron's butt rub right there. Oops, let me, because I'm just having salt. Curry, would you like some pepper on yours? Yes. Yeah. No? It's hot. Okay, you guys. 
ground beef and eggs over hard for breakfast. Looks good. Looks good. Okay, you guys, we are getting ready to go for a ride. Sally knows what that is. That's her water. Let me keep it in a little um, cooler for her to have. She loves cold water. She's so spoiled, I tell you. You guys, that breakfast, that ground beef, those eggs were heaven. Oh my gosh, they were good. <laughs> I don't know if it's because I haven't had eggs in like, it seems like forever or what, but it was just the perfect combination. Don't you think so, Harry? Oh yeah. Um, I do need to go to Bash's and get some more ground hamburger because it tasted so delicious. I want to have more of those. So we'll share everything that we do and we'll come back later, you guys. Well, you guys, we just got back from our ride. We had to go to Bash's to pick up a few things for my mom. And I grabbed some stuff for the freezer from the meat sale. I stopped at a Sprouts. They had Topo Chico. They had 12 bottles, a case, on sale for $10.99, you guys, which is a really good price. The Topo Chico at Bash's for one bottle is $1.29 on sale. So that was a great buy. So I picked those up. I was looking for uh, Zevia. The root beer was the only thing they were totally sold out, sold out of, and they didn't have any Zevia energy drinks. So I don't know what's going on with those. It's a plot. Anyway, you guys, I love Perrier Strawberry uh, Sparkling Water. They uh, only had one box and one bottle, and it was buy two, oh, they have bottles get too. $2 off. So any two Perriers. So I got those. Um, with my coupon, and I'm really loving the strawberry flavor. So, you guys, I picked out the fattiest Chuck because there were some really thin ones in there, but I wanted the this? fat. This is Chuck. Oh, okay. Chuck steak. Look what we got there. Nine dollars and eleven cents. Two ninety nine a pound. Oh, so it's twin pack. Yes, nine eighty three for this. Two ninety nine a pound. And then the hamburger, ground hamburger, was nine seventy. You guys, Didn't and this you, one's eighty five fifteen. Did Mom you have got, hamburger with me this morning? Yes, that's why like I got. It? Oh, I loved oh, it. Oh, I own that good hamburger and eggs. How can you pass up oh, that? Oh God, that was How good. can you pass that up? That's oh, my why God. I bought this. We're gonna ground this for tomorrow. So yes. anyway, you guys, all this was forty three dollars and thirty four cents. I saved. It was forty three, thirty four. Wow. You saved more than you spent? Yes. We are going to put this away and then we'll probably uh, start dinner. Probably cook up a steak, one of these chuck steaks, and call it an evening. So anyway, we had a great day with mom. Mom really enjoyed it. It was really hot out there. Didn't see anything it? to, to Didn't see any you. animals. It was just too hot. The animals are all under the shade trees and down in the washes and stuff until later tonight. Yep. So anyway, folks, we'll... Give me a chance to put all this stuff away, get the meat in the freezer, and then we'll come back. This strawberry puree is delicious. Yeah, it almost tastes like real strawberries. It does. It tastes like real strawberries. It's really good. Okay, you guys. We are cooking the last meal. We're having steak. In case you didn't guess. So this is day 28. Yeah. Okay. Is that right? This is my seventh day of eating elimination diet. This morning I had eggs. And they were so dang delicious, weren't they, Harry? Yeah. They were really good because we had them with hamburger. Yes, they were good. And they had them with ground hamburger. Oh, it was delicious. Okay, you guys. That's got a little piece of meat on it. Okay. Put some salt on this. I'm still not using any other seasoning, and I'm just adding eggs, you guys, for three days. Yeah, I'm kind of curious to see what happens tomorrow. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, me too, I am too. But I'm weighing it, I already have a key, how much I need and everything. 400, seven minutes, Mark said go. Anyway, you guys, we'll come back when it's steak. But those eggs were delicious. Let's see what I weigh tomorrow, you guys. Because I've been doing my water, my salt. All I did was add two eggs for breakfast. That's eight, almost nine. And I'm supposed to have 9.5 or 10. So it's I eight, say? 
0.861. Okay, good. Oh yeah, watch your feet. Piece of 13, it, and that should do it. Yep, yeah. that should do it. That's a big piece of meat, Kenny. Okay, you guys, we are gonna let these rest, but let me share these with you guys because these, this is the first Chuck steaks. You guys, look at that. Mmm, delicious. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 They've got to rest, but you guys, we're gonna close our vlog out. And tomorrow is Monday, and we are going to eat this, and then we're going to sit down and watch some vlogs and chill for the rest of the day. Hey, if you guys like what you see, please hit the like button, subscribe, ring the bell so you guys get notified when we have our next vlog up, you guys, and share it with a friend. Let them know. Anyway, folks, we'll see you tomorrow.